Good evening, everyone. We're Communicators of Clarity, and the campaign we're presenting this evening is Healthier Together. Mr. Partridge, it's been 91 days since we were in this room for our first client orientation where we heard you say. I referenced that we were clients who needed clarity, and I'm learning from Professor Basso what marketing and branding is. Well said. Tonight, we're going to add to your already substantial knowledge of branding. You make the connections. You make oh. <laughs> We're going to add to your already substantial knowledge of branding because we are communicators of clarity. We're going to keep it simple, speak directly, and address the health department's purpose in a way that will make it clear enough for everyone to understand. Identity is who you are. It's been a long ride in learning what exactly the health department's job is, and we've come a long way. From thinking that LDCHD performs restaurant inspections to getting lost on the way to your building, we now feel confident in explaining both the clinical and community-based actions that the health department takes. Be the primary source. This identity reflects the authority that the LDCHD holds within the community. Community members should be able to come to you with any health-related questions, and identifying yourself as the primary source of information will allow this interaction to take place. To better reflect this identity as the primary leader on health information, we recommend that the LDCHD speak with authority and develop its own voice, becoming a visible leader within the community. One example of leadership that I experienced was during my trip to Tulsa. Dr. Bruce Dart, the director, made the effort to contact Tulsa newspapers that cited the Oklahoma City Health Department in an article. He made sure the reporters knew that the Tulsa Health Department is willing, able, and happy to be the city's source of health information. We make the connections, you make the difference. This was stated by Caitlin Schneider, the public information officer for Tulsa. This really struck a chord with us because we know that this is one of Lawrence Douglas County Health Department's biggest strengths. You are here to inform and help the community take action. We make the connection, you make the difference, is the Tulsa Health Department slogan for Pathways to Health, its accreditation program, and is how it began involving businesses and community members. Your campaign is called Healthier Together, and it's our hope that this slogan will act as a conduit for your goals of being the go-to source in Lawrence and Douglas County. Just as Tulsa's slogan helped to communicate with the health department as a resource, Healthier Together will communicate the LDCHD as part of the relationship business. Programs are what you do. Right now, you're most known for WIC and immunization programs. However, in order to establish yourself as the primary source of information, you need to communicate your place in the relationship business. This can be done through a series of programs that gets you online, gets you in the community, and makes your mark in Lawrence and Douglas County. This photo of a newspaper clip about the health department is a great example of the LDCHD gaining recognition within the community. Ask a Mom is an online forum for mothers of all ages to share advice. We all know who our number one is, our most trusted authority, it's our moms. From breastfeeding to the first day of school, moms in Lawrence and Douglas County can log in at their convenience and swap stories, advice, and guidance. Along with mothers, Health professionals of the LDCHD will also be sharing information online in order to ensure validity. When Ask a Mom was presented in a focus group with the LDCHD staff, the response was very positive. One comment was that it would be a beneficial program to assist mothers who use WIC. This is especially relevant for community members who work full time or do not have family in the area. This program will help establish LDC's LDCHD's reputation in the relationship business and further promoting the slogan, Healthier Together. What's the deadliest animal, animal that lives in Lawrence? I've heard about Lyme's disease. Do you get that from Lyme's? What are the chances of getting Ebola in Lawrence? Health Answered, an online question and answer da database, gives the LDCHD the ability to answer community questions with authority. Based off of the KU info site, Health Answered will be the community's go-to for health-related information. Building healthy relationships. You're in the relationship business, so show the community how you care for the relationship of Douglas County. A program that encourages healthy relationships between all community members, seniors, parents, and children will bring the idea of Healthier Together to the front of people's minds. For one month each year, Healthier Together Month will focus on community issues that could vary from senior citizen involvement to recognizing healthy relationships. Ambassadors for Health. Chip Blazer, the community commissioner, said in an interview, reaching those people who are not already involved should be a primary priority in public health. Imagine a group of college students at, a senior, at senior centers, colleges, and flu clinics sporting health department t-shirts. Imagine 
putting a face to the health department and allowing community members to ask questions about the health department in a face-to-face -face interaction. During intercept interviews and also the focus group with LDCHD, many people expressed their excitement at the idea of health department ambassadors going out into the community to increase awareness. Ambassadors for Health is a new way to involve people throughout Lawrence and Douglas County in public health. When these ambassadors go out into the community, they need to ma maintain a consistent identity. This t-shirt would be worn by student ambassadors so that they all look uniform yet youthful. The Lawrence Douglas County Health Department logo is directly on the front of the t-shirt above the word ambassador. The blue of the t-shirt stays consistent with the color identity of the health department. We incorporated Healthier Together on the back of the t-shirt with multicolored figures encircling the text to illustrate relationship building and connecting the members of the community. <coughs> Communications, how you do it. Carrie, you have done a fantastic job of creating and maintaining social media platforms. Though, in continuing our campaign's theme, goal, and goal of Healthier Together, we have a few recommendations to incorporate the community relationship theme and the LDCHD social media accounts and advertisements. It's not what you say, it's how you say it. Tom Schluter, the health communications coordinator of Kane County, said this during our visit to their health department. This is applicable to the LDCHD communications as well. It doesn't matter if you're putting out great, helpful information if no one's paying attention to it. Get the community members' attention with social media. Your Facebook and Twitter posts should spark conversation. Tag local businesses and community members so that everyone is included in the social media conversations. You're in the relationship business, so use this media to connect with others. It's especially important to stay consistent with the identity mentioned earlier of being the primary source. Provide flyers, lively graphics, and relevant information on the Facebook page. Instead of outsourcing and finding flyers others have created, create your own self-made branded infographics photos, and news stories. This way, your styles are consi consistent, your audience can grow, and the credibility of the health department will skyrocket. And now for a new twist on a platform that's already active, YouTube. Videos should carry the theme of clarity and simplicity, staying shorter than a minute. In Tulsa, the YouTube videos were informative, silly, and entertaining. They achieved the goal for portraying useful information and also getting people to view and understand the message. The LDCHD would benefit from using a similar technique by explaining programs and services in short, animated videos. Lastly, a main page video lends credibility and clarity to every business's YouTube page. Right now, the LDCHD doesn't have a video, but we decided to take care of that. The Lawrence Douglas County Health Department has a mission of promoting health for all through advancing policies, practices, and programs that prevent disease and protect the environment. The LDCHD was awarded the 2014 Health Department of the Year, recognizing the good they do in the community. With clinic services like WIC, immunizations and family planning, and regulatory services such as child care licensing, sanitary code enforcement, and pool regulations, the Health Department is for everyone in Douglas County. There are even programs for parents, pregnancy and breastfeeding support groups, support for seniors, and well child exams all work together to make a happier and healthier community. In addition to working with community partners such as the Lawrence Public School System, the health department also works with local partners for public health preparedness to stay a step ahead of disease outbreaks and keep the city safe. The LDCHD encourages everyone to live a healthy, happy, and active lifestyle. Together, day by day, building a healthy community. Advertising in the community. Advertisements work best when they are positioned in a location that maximizes target market views. Mr. Partridge, you mentioned that the low-income community is a target market of the LDCHD services. Public transportation advertisements will portray creative messages that stay with the LDCHD brand while promoting relevant services. Brand hand sanitizers not only promote healthiness in a germ-free environment, but also the LDC LDCHD itself. These hand sanitizers can include fun facts about health. It is also important to state the best bus route to take in order to get to the health department. For our final ta-da piece, we've put together something that combines the health department's activity throughout the community, an LDCHD 2015 calendar. We have an example right here for you to look at. 
Available for staff as well as schools, senior homes, or anyone in the community, the LDCHD calendar has photos throughout of the Lawrence community, residents, and the health department. Each LDCHD event is marked, as well as healthy activities like the farmer's market. We've created the calendar online, and we'll pass along the res responsibility to you with the login and password, which will allow you to access the calendar, add important events, and pictures that you want, and make new copies as needed to hand out to community partners. Our team, Communicators of Clarity, has truly enjoyed working with you this semester. After months of brainstorming, talking to community members, and having too much fun during um, our work nights debating the merits of the color green, we feel confident that making these recommendations, which illustrate the LDCHD in a way that is fun, informative, and attention getting, so that the message is viewed and retained by everyone in the community. Mr. Partridge and LDCHD staff, thank you for the opportunity. We've truly enjoyed having you as a client.